thank you for We are here at Craven Cottage, the home of Fulham FC. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Our football is from the EFL Championship in England. It's Fulham against Charlton Athletic. Yeah, thanks, Martin. Looking forward to it. I think we're going to have an entertaining tussle here. I think we'll find that out in the first 10 minutes, how these teams have broke the task. They've been a high-scoring team throughout the season, haven't they? And there's no question that they're a very good watch. We're delighted to be here to watch them again today. They are the entertainers in this division. They've been really good, really potent in front of goal. And here it is for Fulham. This is their team for this match. Anthony Knockout starts, looking to continue his great form in midfield. And at the point of attack, just one lone striker. Now a check on Charlton Athletic. There have been some negative comments, haven't there, Alan, about the way this team defends. Do you see them as a very negative side? Well, they can be, uh, and I don't expect things to change today because they have achieved results off the back of it. Defend deep, defend in numbers, and uh, difficult to break down. Well, that looked dangerous until he made the interception. Taking on a couple of opponents now. The break is definitely on. Onside and away. And that's a brilliant goal. Well taken. No goal. Flag up. Well, that assistant there, he was certain the flag went up straight away. Four on the ball. Mitrovic. He's way off target. On the attack here. Oh, he's through. Oh, great chance. Well, he has started fast and they've started fast. That's the opening goal. Well, it's a fine individual counter-attack, isn't it? What a goal from him. Let's see the replay now. Oh, look at the manager. He works hard on his team on the training ground and he's seen some reward for it down there now. It's Fulham now who have the lead. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. No nonsense defending from him. They've lost the ball. He's one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. Clean through, one-on-one -on -one against the goalkeeper. Yeah, it's a wonderful stop, Martin, isn't it? And uh, no bits and pieces either to follow up on. Corner swung in. We have some goal news for you from Nottingham Forest. And our reporter is Alan McInally. It's a goal for Nottingham Forest. 14 minutes played, 1-0. Thank you very much, Alan. Gruber. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. It's a quick break. In the clear in front of goal. They couldn't stop him the first time. They haven't stopped him the second time. And he's leading his team in the best possible way with two goals today. So slick, so quick, Alan. Well, once he got going, those defenders were never going to catch him. What a finish, too. Different angle on it here.
restarting at 2-0. This could be it. In with a chance. Good save. He's got skill with the ball. Backing himself in these circumstances. Gruber. It could be a chance. Oh, fantastic goal. And that's the third, the hat-trick. It's a day he'll never forget. Well, he's enjoyed one of those days where everything he's tried has come off and that match ball will be on his sideboard tonight. So off they go again, trying to make some sort of mark in a game that they're being dominated in. He's confident with the ball at his feet, isn't he? Gruber. He's through. The shot's on. Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. if you do the difficult thing in the right areas and it comes off this is what happens you get a great goal sometimes you see somebody beat a couple of opponents and then it comes to nothing but this fella made sure he had an end product to that wonderful bit of skill well it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing